Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to your daily tarot reading for Tuesday, July 21st, 2020. Let's get these cards shuffled up, shall we? And let's see what the energy for today is going to be all about. What kind of strategies we want to keep in mind and what kind of key words we want to keep in mind as we get into our day. And I'm just going to do a couple of cuts. And one more. All right, I think we're good to go. Let's get these cards laid out. And let's see where we're going today, shall we? There we are. And for today, I am kind of feeling this last pile, or first pile, whichever way you want to look at it, right? So let's see what we have for a card. And we have temperance. So let's talk a bit about temperance, a major arcana card. And um, some things we want to keep in mind when we get into temperance, right? So, like I like doing, let's keep, um, come up with some key words to keep in mind. One of the first words that comes to me when I think about temperance is balance. It's all about balance. It's about balancing out what we have going on in our life, what we have um, going on in our segments of our life. It's about balancing out the segments even. When we look at balance, um, we got to look at what are we doing for work versus what are we doing for play and for our home life. When we look at the larger picture of it all, it's also about peace and patience, about moderation, about not going into all one thing, all balls to the wall and letting other things fall behind. Temperance can also be about perspective, putting things into perspective, taking a closer look at where you are, as well as being about harmony. When we look at the general context, it's all about reminding you to be moderate, to be patient, to be at peace with what's going on, and to maintain um, a balance in your life. Whether you already have it or whether you need to work on it, it's all about really bringing up that vibe to a more harmonious level. Um, when we look at it from a love and relationship standpoint, it's probably one of the better cards to get out of the whole deck because it really signifies a real strong balance, a real strong harmonious relationship going on, whether it be with a significant other, with friends, with family, whatever it might be. Um, along with that, if there are some issues going on right now in interpersonal relationships, this card is all about reminding you that things are out of balance. Listen to that um, inner voice. Listen to whomever is talking to you. And you may have to adjust things a little bit to bring things more closely into balance. And now from a career um, standpoint and a money standpoint, it's a great time right now to be setting up some goals. It's a good time to maintain some patience and some persistence to achieve what it is that you want. This is also a good time for you to collaborate with others in a harmonious way, um, in a way that is offering um, give and take and listening to other viewpoints and balancing them in with your own viewpoint to come up with that study paced forward motion that you need to reach goals. So when we look at this, it's a very positive card. One thing you do want to be remindful of is be aware of um, just going into extremes of behavior. This card is all about balance. It's all about temperance. And the opposite to that, of course, is being extreme. So make sure as you're going out there today and going out there forward that you keep that inner peace with you, that you keep that inner balance with you, that you think, um, approach things with moderation, and that you keep an open ear and you listen to others' viewpoints so that it balances out with your own viewpoints to move everything that you want moving forward, forward. So I hope you enjoyed this reading for today. Good card for Tuesday, I feel. Look forward to seeing you all again tomorrow. And until then, be safe, be well, and as always, be blessed.